Hi folks, Max from HighOnAndroid.com where we get high on Android every day. Anyway, um, many of you probably installed this already, but in case you haven't, Android 4.3, a Photosphere camera is here. Uh, you, all you have to do is download the APK and install it. Let me kind of show you around. Um, this is the 4.3 camera. It's different because you'll get the landscape instead of uh, the other the other uh, method. Here you have the exposure uh, you can change there and also additional more options here um, you can choose uh, different scenes night um, that's for the like uh, lights party and uh, daylight there and also you can switch to front camera and users have reported this has worked on every device um, so far every device I've used on my phones have been working uh, and also of course Photosphere now you can get Photosphere on any 4.2.2 ROMs 4.1.2 whatever and this is uh, a, a lot better Photosphere a lot works a lot better than before I'm um, so very nice and you can get this um, and also does come with uh, Android 4.3 gallery so you can actually see um, the actual Photosphere here we go it's stitching panorama there and let's go back and see the photosphere uh, photo I just took there we go so very nice let me go ahead and show you how to install it um, on my Nexus 4 now if you install it on a Nexus device it's gonna uh, replace whatever camera you have which isn't a big deal um, go ahead and go to my site download androidrom.com I'll have the actual link and go ahead and download it straight to your phone um, and once it's downloaded, if you can't open the file for some reason, uh, you can go ahead and use a file explorer. Or let me go to downloads here. Let me see if I can do that now. It won't let me open. Let me go ahead and download a yes file explorer real quick. Now this APK file should work on any Android device running uh, 4.1.1 and up. Uh, Jelly Bean, anything Jelly Bean. I've not tried it on ICS. If you want to try it on ICS, you can. Um, just make sure you make a backup ROM before you do it so you can revert back if something goes wrong. Um, once you've downloaded, go to download folder and go ahead and find the actual APK file which is the camera. Let me change the view here so you can see better. Uh, camera.google.playedition.apk. Go ahead and install that and this will install the new camera and I've actually got, uh, I got Paranoid Android ROM running here and uh, oops let me go ahead and just open the camera to show you that I have it working something's wrong with that ROM I'm running, or something's wrong with the ROM there we go so it's working fine here and you'll get the new photosphere uh, the new photosphere camera so anybody can install it go ahead and install it now I do notice something going kind of funky here no no it's not it's working fine um, so check it out for your Android device. You don't need root for this. Just go ahead and download uh, and install the APK. Enjoy your uh, Android 4.3 Photosphere camera along with um, you know TouchWiz camera if you have a TouchWiz ROM on a Samsung device. Um, if you have an AOSP ROM, it's just going to simply replace your camera. And yeah, that's about it. And as, as always, um, if you like this video, don't forget to hit the like button for me here. Subscribe button down there. And I'll see you guys soon. Stay high on Android. Ah. Uh.